Hi guys, it's December 10th. The last thing I filmed was like around Halloween and I totally skipped Thanksgiving. We stayed here for Thanksgiving. Um, I didn't expect to, well actually we thought about maybe going to his like family's house, but I wasn't expecting to go home or anything. But still I felt a little homesick. So that really made me want, I'm just jumping right into this. <laughs> that really made me want to try to go home for Christmas this year. But um, Dustin has two jobs now. I don't even think that was talked about yet because like I said, I haven't been filming. I mean, he always had two jobs, but now he has a different second job. <laughs> and he has to work on like Christmas Eve, Christmas, and the day after Christmas. So realistically, we wouldn't be able to like drive up for Christmas. If like maybe he had to work on like Christmas Day, we could have still driven up or something. But he has to work like every day. So that's not going to happen. I mean, he gets to work from home at least, but it doesn't really like leave us an option to go home for Christmas. So. That's gonna be different this year. Um, but I told my family, I'm like, call me on Zoom, like include me, I'd love to be included. Anyways, hey, um, yeah, it's December 10th. I'll show you the Christmas decorations and the tree. I don't know if you can see him. Lambert, yeah, you can see him. He freaking loves the tree. He loves to climb up in the tree. He loves to knock ornaments out of the tree. He is obsessed and I have had a cat in the past, but I don't remember, oh, I'm really zoomed in because I was sitting further away. I don't remember like Christmas trees being an issue with my cat, but I don't know. I was younger then. I think I like, when she was older, I was in high school, but I don't remember. My cat didn't really like enjoy being around people, she was always hidden. I, I feel like this is how I remember it. Um, so I don't really remember if she was always in the tree. I don't think she was. Anyways, but this guy, yeah, he loves climbing in the tree, getting into trouble. I think the last time I really talked about him in the last vlog, he was having like health issues. It seems to be that has died down. However, he has had recently like two flare ups where he has like gagging issues or like hacking issues. I've noticed it like two times so far. Um, I think. I come to the conclusion personally, but I'm not a vet, that it's because he like drinks water too fast because it always seems to happen like after he drinks. So I don't know. I've tried to incorporate like wet foods into his dry foods so he like doesn't feel the need to drink as much water or like water so quickly because he doesn't feel like dehydrated. So that's what's up with Lambert. Today we have this thing in town called Christmas on Main Street. There's gonna be like a bunch of vendors. We've never been there obviously because it's our first year in Lynn, so we're gonna go. I really wanna record and show you what it's like, but I think most of it's gonna be in like this one main building. And considering this is a really small town, I feel like it'd be weird to just like whip out my camera, but I'll try. I don't think I'll talk, but I'll try to film some like B-roll or something. Lambert's looking out the window. I really hope I can get some. Um, they have carriage rides and everything. I really want to do one, but I'm not sure if there's going to be like a big line or anything. And it's a little bit cold. It's in the 40s. I don't think it's windy though, so that's good. Um, oh, also I'm wearing my hair parted down the middle. It doesn't look good today because I didn't style it. I got a haircut from a hairdresser, which I've like pretty much never done. I've got it colored at like two different hairdressers, but I've never specifically gone for a haircut ever because my mom always did my hair and it went okay. I wish she did a little bit more layers, but um, like she curled it up. Like, okay, I'm <laughs> talking so fast. I just want to get this beginning out of the way. She cut it and I, then I didn't get a look at it after she cut it because I can't like, I didn't have my glasses on so I couldn't see. And she was like, do you want me to style it for you? I was like, sure. So I didn't get to see it just like straight, but I got to see it curled and I was like, this is perfect. This is awesome. I love it. I do love it. But I wish it did have more layers. I got the butterfly cut. Like here's an example of some butterfly cuts. Mine doesn't look like that when I just dry it because I don't usually ever style it. But it's down the middle because you're supposed to wear it down the middle. But I don't usually ever like do anything with my hair. I usually have it in a ponytail. Or when I go out these days I have a hat on because it's cold. I'm going to wear a hat today. My face is really red. I don't know why. Like I just took care of my face today after the shower. I like spritzed it with some toner. I rubbed like these cold roller on it but I don't know I don't know why I look like this but um Dustin's getting ready and then we're gonna go I think we're gonna walk so hopefully I can show you what that's all about I'm excited Lambert has to stay home though sorry Lambert he's just looking out the window he likes this window he didn't used to ever sit on the window sill he used to sit right here on this ottoman I just have it sitting in front of the window for him but I blew dry blow dried my hair today so I had to Move the ottoman over. Ain't that right, Lambert? He's been really sweet lately. Um, he's enjoyed sleeping in the bed. Not not like when we're sleeping in the bed, but whenever we're just like hanging out in the living room, he'll come to the bed and sleep. Even though he has that cat tree, he's just um, like the past couple days, he's been enjoying sleeping in the bed. Oh, so actually a couple more things. 
something we found out about cats um since lambert likes to go in the tree we found out that glitter is not good for cats which like makes sense obviously because if oh i'm so so sorry because if they ingest glitter like you think that would mess up their breathing and whatnot so most of my like all of my decorations were glittery so i had to take them all off you can like watch previous videos to see the decorations i had and then i got like a lot of these balls and this thing and this from walmart just to try to fill out my tree because i do have some other decorations that weren't glittery but most of everything else was glittery so i put that in storage but i don't see how i can use that ever with a cat um and lambert because he loves the tree so much i'm not able to put any presents under the tree they're just all of our shoes. Oh, this I got for him recently. There's just shoes around the tree and <laughs> that's it. He likes that little tunnel thing. It's part of a bigger Christmas present I got for him, but I just gave him this little tunnel to explore to see if he likes it before I bring out the big guy um, at Christmas time. But he really enjoys it. And here he is using it. He's inside of it. He likes to roll around in it and play with toys in it. I really just gave it to him last night. So I don't know how much he really likes it or if he just likes it because it's new, but so far, it seems like a hit. I can't wait to give him <laughs> the bigger part of it. Here's another toy of his. He plays with it about maybe once a day. He'll hit a ball and then walk away from it. Okay, here we are. We couldn't park in the parking lot. I almost tripped because these are un uneven. Um, but there's a carriage right up there. There's some fire trucks because it's going to be at the firehouse slash police station slash municipal building because it's a small town. Here's Dustin. <laughs> Hey guys, me and Dustin just got a picture with Santa. <laughs> I'll put it in the vlog right here. Can you believe that? Now we're gonna go in the library. I've never been in here before ever. We're just driving now. We went to the event. Dustin's vlogging me. We're picking up some pizza, but we're just driving around now. Here we are at Pizza Barn Lynn. Try not to shoot her car, which is right underneath the shot, but you just go up to that pickup window over there and you pick up your pizza. This is our favorite cat. He hangs out by the pizza shop. He's so cute. Hey, Dustin. We got the goods secured. <laughs> Okay, we just got home. Dustin got some breadsticks and a calzone. I'm gonna have the these tacos we made. Um, but here is the one thing that I ended up getting from the Christmas on Main Street. And here it is. It's like this little ceramic thing. The lady painted it, and she has her like shop that you can go to and paint it yourself. Um, but it's it lights up. You can't really tell until I turn the light off. So here it is. Isn't that so cute? I know that these are like have vintage ones of these um this one obviously isn't vintage but it like there's a replica or something and i think it's so cute i don't know where i'm gonna put it but i love it and as you can see behind this is kind of a spoiler on um, the christmas decorations i did i really like this section it's probably one of my favorites and then we just got like our drinks out on the counter and these are lambert's waters but just wanted to show you my little find okay and i'm having tacos well a burrito and i got some avocado lettuce refried beans with caramelized onions a tomato slash pico salsa corn salsa so good and some leftover rice from yesterday i feel like i'm missing something but i think that's it it was really good yesterday okay it's a little bit later now i have eight it was really good um and i just want to show you some christmas things before i end the video i do want to say that when we were in town i don't think i filmed <laughs> Well, you already saw the clips. I don't think I filmed very cohesively, but I was just trying to film things here and there when I felt comfortable. One thing I didn't get to film, and we also didn't get to do, was the carriage rides. I don't know if you could tell, the water, the water, <laughs> the weather wasn't the best today. 
it wasn't so cold it's been colder especially when it's been windier um, but it was a little bit like sprinkly out so it wasn't that fun to be in that weather and when we first got there the carriage rides were really long but when we were leaving they were short but we had a place that order to get um, go pick up the pizza so we couldn't really wait in line but and I did film a one clip of the carriage rides but it was so blurry that I just deleted it immediately after because I was thinking I was gonna get another one but I didn't but it looked really cool um, anyways, I'm going to show you some Christmas decorations, and then that'll be the video. Okay, these aren't really going to be any different at all from what you've already seen, like, when I lived at my apartment. And I'm going to turn the lights off here in a second. Um, but I just want to show you where I put them in this house. Oops, I remember it's, like, standing in the door, and I'm trying to close on him because I'm trying to get to the light switch. And also I have my Christmas trees up here, my little mini ones. They would be up here, but Lambert likes to go on this area and bat them off. He even likes to like try to push these guys over and I wish he wouldn't. This guy, Lambert didn't break him. He already came broken last year. I think I accidentally broke him out of the packaging, but I just set him back on the snow. But that's why I can't decorate it with trees because Lambert likes to bat them off. But I just have some things scattered in the bookshelf. Bookshelf was kind of like a last resort where I just threw things that I couldn't like fit in with other stuff. You guys already know I had this ET doll. Dustin got me this ET Pop Funko for Christmas. I had it on my wish list and I really, really, really wanted it. He gave it to me early. I love it. I got him set out with Big ET. I'm, I really wanted that one. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna turn off the lights. He also got me a cookbook early. Oh my gosh, it looks so good with the lights off. I don't often um, have this on because I'm not really in the bedroom unless I'm going to sleep and then like I don't want to accidentally fall asleep with them on, but it looks so cute. All right, there goes Lambert. Here we have the Christmas tree with the lights off. Shoes are still scattered around it because <laughs> we don't have a shoe holder. Oh, and Sonic, I see, has fallen to the floor. And that was probably because of Lambert. We got some fun ornaments this year. Like we got Snoopy, because Dustin likes Snoopy. He's got a Snoopy guy over here who like reacts to the sun and he'll nod. Anything that's knocking over, it's because of Lambert. <laughs> Anything that's fallen over, it's because of Lambert. And then also I got a pickle ornament. I had Dustin buy it for me. <laughs> and I hid it in the tree because that was like a tradition at my grandma's house. So it's somewhere in this tree. I don't think Dustin's tried to find it yet. We have, some, <laughs> this was on the tree. Lambert knocked it down, of course. Some Christmas decor back there, just little houses. I used to have those at my desk at work. Letters to Santa stuff over there. And then I'll show you like the kitchen area. Here's my desk, here's the area by my desk. I used to call it my coffee bar, but my coffee maker's not out here anymore. I had it out here when I was working, but I do not have a job ever since my job concluded. Still haven't gotten one yet. I apply for a million jobs a day, but anyways, we're not gonna talk about that in this video. Here's just the rest of my decorations. It's kind of like mirrored on both sides because we have, well, that candle's not supposed to be there. <laughs> it's supposed to be back here, but everything is like the same on each side. And then this is supposed to be in the middle. I didn't really clean up much before this video. I did move some things around, but, and here is, sorry for the um, bad word, but here's a cookbook D Dustin got me all on his own. He got that for me and it's so nice. I already looked at all of it, took down some recipes I want to try to make. I also had a lot more cookbooks, but I condensed them to like all my favorite ones. So I'm really happy about that. And I made this guy right here <laughs> out of like some kids Play-Doh or not Play-Doh. It was supposed to be air drying clay. And this is how it turned out. I, I like mushrooms. I think they're cute. I based it off of that mushroom. <laughs> it doesn't look that good. I also made some other stuff, which is in the kitchen. Lambert, always begging for food, always. Um, that's the thing I bought today. That's where it ended up. Let me turn off the light. You can't really see it unless like all the lights are off, but I really, really love it. This is kind of like what I've deemed to be my vintage inspired corner. We got the deers, this like fake old timey radio and now that tree i used to have my grandma um she made me the wine bottle with lights but i moved it it's now over here and i really actually prefer it over here because look how the lights bounce off the toaster oven how sick does that look i'm in love let me turn the lights on i have i got this from an estate sale a spoon rest just some random stuff over here the mushroom <laughs> I bought a paper towel holder and the mushroom was supposed to go on top of it, but the paper towel holder got arrived broken, so I just kept the top the mushroom right there, threw away it, the paper towel holder. We do have one already, but it's kind of getting rusty at the bottom. That's not why I have the paper towel there, it's just extra. <laughs> and anyway, so I'm looking for a new one. 
and then here's some stuff over here we got a little cookie jar this is a candle i bought dustin i think last year for christmas i shipped it to him and he still has it i mean he didn't light it or anything so i'm just having it out for display and i got some stuff in here it's like dear santa letters and whatnot just from like stuff from my coworkers slash friends keepsakes I accidentally stopped filming too soon. I was like, that is everything done. Uh, I used to, I was gonna say, I had said, I used to have stuff in the bathroom, but I kind of switched up the decor in the bathroom because I got some random like candlestick stuff. Right there and right there. Um, so I'm testing out how that's gonna look. I think I'm gonna put that in other places once Christmas is over, but that's where they are now. And then I'm trying not to show Lambert's litter box. Then I got that little Lego building kit that I made. It's really cute. It was so hard to make though, it hurt my fingers so bad. Um, so I took the Christmas stuff out of the bathroom and we have that in there now. Oh, and I was gonna show you the other thing I made out of the air drying clay. I think I would like to get legitimate clay. Um, cause it was really fun, I just didn't like this clay in particular. I made this little fake egg. I don't like eggs, I didn't like eggs before I became vegan, but I love how egg decor looks, I think it's so cute. It's just sitting on this little spoon rest here. I'm not using it cause I got the Christmas one out. Just have it sitting there, <laughs> it's so cute. But that's all, so. Thanks for watching. Bye.